Hello everyone, welcome to Beauty News. Myself, Hamid Reza. Our today's headline is how Airbus tried to use fighter jet for space tourism. Space tourism sounds exciting, but it is wildly expensive. In the early 2000s, Airbus had an idea to make it cheaper by creating MiGBus, a transparent passenger capsule strapped to a MiG-31 fighter jet. At present, private space exploration is one of the hot topic in the aerospace industry. It evolved from the huge interest in the sector back in the early 1990s through to the mid-2000s. As relatively cheap technology became available to Westerners after the dissolution of Soviet Union and before the space flight was derailed in the United States in 2004, a slew of private ventures popped up, promising an exciting adventure beyond the atmosphere and a trip to the former Soviet Union to go with it. It was the freshly formed European Aeronautic Defense and Space Company which manufactured aerospace aircraft. The company, which later changed its name to Airbus, tried to jump on the train with a space oriented subsidiary, Astrium SI, later renamed EADS Space Transportation, conducted a series of studies exploring the market, evaluating competitors, and looking for proposals that could rival them. Moving to our next headline is Passenger Traffic Continues to Retour. IDA announced passenger data for September 2022 showing that the recovery in air travel continues to be strong. Total traffic in September 2022 measured in revenue passenger kilometers rose 57.0 compared with September 2021 globally. Traffic is now at 73.8% of September 2019 levels. Domestic traffic for September 2022 was up 6.9% compared with the year ago period. Total September 2022 domestic traffic was 81% of the September 2019 level. International traffic climbed 122.2% versus September 2021. September 2022 international RPKS reached 69.9% of September 2019 levels. All marked reported strong growth led by Asia Pacific. Even with economic and geopolitical uncertainties, the demand of air transport continues to recover ground. The outliner is still China, with its pursuit of a zero-COVID strategy keeping borders largely closed and creating a demand roller coaster ride for its domestic market. With September being down 46.4% on the previous year, this is in sharp constant to the rest of Asia Pacific which despite China's decimal performance posted in 464.8% increase from international traffic compared with the year ago period, said Willie Walsh, IATA Director General. Strong demand in helping the industry cope with sky-high fuel price, he continued. To support that demand in the long term, we need to pay attention to what travelers are telling us. After nearly three years of pandemic travel complexity, IDAS 2022 Global Passenger Survey GPS shows that travelers want simplification and convenience. That's an important message for airlines, but also for airports and government. They owe many of the facilities process that let passengers down at some key. Airport over these years, not than summer travel reasons. According to GPS, a majority of passengers want to use biometric data rather than passport for border processes. And 93% of passengers are interested in trusted travel program to expanded security scanning. Modernizing the facilities experience will not only help elevation the top point, it will create a better experience for all. Thanks, Zarin Khan from Aviator News. Now, I will announce about the job vacancy of Emirates Airways for the student of the College of Aviation Technology. The position is Security Supervisor Dhaka. Job purpose. The Security Supervisor at the station shall be responsible for all security matters or issues and work as the nodal point of contact station for the airport service manager and Emirates Group Security headquarters on all security operational and administrative matters. Job accountabilities. Manager or supervisor the implementation of current aviation security policies and procedures to meet Emirates and local requirements liaising, dealing and coordinating with CAB, airport operators, EOC, immigration, customs, contracted security agency administration, and other relevant authorities administration on security matters 
as directed by the security controller and the EGS headquarter. Qualification and experience degree with minimum of five years aviation industry exposure of which a minimum of three years should have been at a supervisory level in aviation or operational security knowledge and skill in-depth knowledge of aviation security and x 17 of ikl ita security regulation extraordinary security procedures and measures in case of hijack accidents and bomb threats application closing date is 1st december 2022 Thank you everyone.